Alright lads, so today we're going to be reviewing Inform Edinson Cavani, plays for PSG in the league at Earned. He's six foot tall, right footed, got medium medium work rates, a three star weak foot and three star skills. Looking at his in games, his standouts are his 96 stamina, 94 finishing, 94 jumping, 90 shot power and 90 attack positioning. We have also included all the upgrades over his non inform as a comparison for you. So you can see each individual stat increase of all of his stats. So you can always pause it if you want a close look at any of these now. So this is the team we'll be using Inform Cavani in, a 4-3-3 PSG team with Cavani at striker. So now onto the gameplay so you can see how it was performing. So I am luckily able to bring you this review as we did actually get him in a free pack. So it was a stroker look as he is really hard to find on the market as usual with these uh, informs and price ranges. And I was actually surprised to see him uh, get his inform in a striker role. I really did think he was playing on the left uh, in that game, but I'm not complaining. Certainly Mud would much rather have him as a striker than rather stuck out on that wing. And Cavani was awesome up top for us in the middle in that 4-3-3 formation. Was so dominant, does have decent pace on him. Acceleration's not too good, but when he gets going, he does actually surge through the defences. And he does have his good dribbling and agility to go with that as well. So, superb on the ball, feels nice and tidy on the dribble. Only a little negative is his medium, medium work rates. Which, as you know, I do not like on strikers, but... To counter it a bit, he does have his 90 attack positioning, which did help him out a bit in that department. He did make some great runs up top, get into some great attacking positions as well to receive the ball. And his shooting ability was so, so good. And from almost any situation as well, whether it's outside of a box with his 90 shot power and 83 long shots, he is able to crack off some great long shots. Didn't get this cracker as well. Or whether it's in the box, making use of his 94 finishing. He's got insane finishing on him. Really, really was clinical in the box for us. And despite his three-star weak foot, still managed to tuck away a few on his left and still managed to get some decent uh, power on him as well. So, not too bad on his weaker foot even though he does have a three star uh, you really really do get the confidence with Cavani that you are going to get the goals really great in front of goal great finishing on him and he is great in the air as well does have 94 jumping and 88 heading so he is going to be able to get up there and win you them headers did grab a couple of headed finishes for us as well so he's a good option for a lone striker role and can manage on his own in a target man role up top he can get up get you them flick ons uh, with his jumping also he is a massive threat from corners and set pieces as well so let's look at Inform Cavani's performance stats. So in six games, he managed to bag an impressive 13 goals, only one assist. All of his stats are on the left, goals are on the right. Position map shows you where goals are scored and his assists were created as well. So overall, we're giving Inform Cavani a cracking 9.2 out of 10. Does make an amazing striker. Really, really love using him. Got good pace on him. Quality shooting as well. Really lethal in that box. And a great aerial threat as well when he's jumping. As we said, good for a target man role. Great for flick-ons. Always got up to meet them uh, goal kicks with his head. And a goal threat from crosses and corners and set pieces. Only little minor negatives were obviously his work rates, which uh, can be countered a bit with his attack positioning. And does have three star weight for and three star skill, but we really didn't have much of a problem with any of these. Love using the ruler, and he's obviously we bagged a few on his left on his weak foot as well. So I can't really complain at all about Cavani. So finally, we're just going to leave you with info on Cavani's positives and negatives to look at. Price range is 350 to 500k on PlayStation and 100 to 160k on Xbox. A decent price for him, but as usual, it's so hard to find. With these price ranges, players are insane to find these days. Luckily, as we said, we got ours in a free pack, unless we may not have been able to do this review. Untradeable, I know, but I really don't want to get rid of him for Cavani. I'm going to look at doing a nice League of One squad builder after team of season comes as well. So hopefully you did enjoy this review. If you did, please leave a like. It does help out a lot. We try to do the most in-depth reviews as we can on YouTube. Please subscribe if you're new to the channel as well. Loads more to check out on the channel. Loads more to come as well. So stay tuned for them. Thanks a lot for watching, lads. Cheers, lads. See you later.